Hi, this is Nunlu Akiangte from RealityX Lite and this is a VFX breakdown of the donut video that I just did. And you might be asking why are we seeing this one? Good questions. So this is because I need to remove all these wires and yeah, all this mess here. So the easiest way is to just scan myself sitting on a chair and I just replaced the lower half of my body with uh, this one and that's why. And it's really funny because I actually have to go through the donut tutorials again to make this short video. And this is a community hall in Mizoram. I just rent it for one day because it's big and we have a lot of uh, room to play. I mean to place the light and move around. But the problem is this window. You see there are so many light source here. So we have to cover all these uh, things first using this black sheet. And here we see the green guys, uh, super cool guys to work with. Um, here we prepare for the default cube and the sprinkles. And once we're done the prep, then we start shooting the scene. Here we can see that the middle guy is wearing this blue thingy. You might be asking why? So this is because um, initially the plan was that when I install Blender, then it got stuck somewhere along the installation. So the middle guy is not yet completely installed. Then uh, we see him without the head. So by wrapping this blue sheet around his head, I can just key these things out. And I actually did that here. So if we take a look at this one, here we can see that this guy head is missing. Uh, but when I add all these things in the final film, then I feel like, nah, the video is a bit too long. You know, it's a bit boring. So I have to cut them down. And there are around 60 shots when I did the first cut. Then I have to cut it down to around like 20 shots, I believe. Um, initially, it was like four, four and a half minutes long video. But I don't want to bore you guys, so I have to trim them down, okay? And for the interior scene, uh, let me show you the behind the scene footage of what happened. So this is my own small studio here in Bangalore. Uh, and I know a lot of you guys are gonna ask me where, uh, where do I live? So right now I am currently in India, okay? And uh, I shot this scene with my brother and one of my students here. Um, instead of using uh, green screen, I just painted all the wall green so that I don't have to worry about uh, fitting the green screen anymore, but I still uh, fit it in some place anyway. So this is my brother uh, with his little gimbal and I am doing the acting uh, this time and the BTS guy, uh, the behind the scene guy is my student, okay? And I have this monitor uh, to see if the shots was good or we have to take another shot. So here I am the director, I am the actor, I am the VFX artist, I am the compositor, so yeah and let me show you the blender file so here we see the green guy uh, the green guys in this scene i asked one of my students to model all the blender ui and he actually did the lighting for this one as well um, i key out the blue screen and then use it as a image uh, images plane uh, to see them here in this viewport now if we take a look at this transition effect it might look a bit complicated but it actually is a very simple image texture so what did I do I just asked my brother to make this texture he's using Sigma 40 to do this one then I just apply this image as texture and then I just mix with some other shader then I need a music that fits perfectly with the film some some of you might not like it but I really like what my brother did here so what did I do so then I asked my brother again to do the music here. Um, he's using FL Studio to create the music. So let me just quickly play that for you guys. And he add all the sound effects uh, on Premiere Pro and then we are using Envato Elements assets for all the sound effects. So let me just play that uh, with sound effects once again.
I spent around one month uh, to make this film and I know that one of you guys gonna ask me how long it takes to render so let me tell you right away I rendered uh, with 4k and I crank up the samples to 300 and then it takes 41 seconds to render one frame so I don't face any problem re uh, regarding the rendering okay here's the task manager uh, for you to see the specs I use RTX 4070 Ti and 128GB RAM and then I use 16 core uh, AMD Ryzen 9 5950X and yeah that's it for now and if you guys want to learn from me I have a private mentorship program where me and my team uh, will guide you step by step on uh, how to I mean whatever I did here on my YouTube channel okay uh, start to finish so if you guys interested the link will be in the description bye bye